One thing I've also noticed this week is a drop in the cost of solar panels, in particular 100 watt solar panels. There's a number of companies out there you can find on Amazon or eBay and I just picked one up at the moment and there are a lot of other solar panels uh, that are being rolled out, the flexible solar panels, so it's driving down the cost of the, the flat rigid solar panels, but a lot of these are being sent out free shipping and I looked at what's happening, uh, what's going on with solar stocks and some of them have, have tumbled as much as 10% and some of them have, have lost as much, one company lost 22% of its profit or something to that effect uh, their uh, stock value dropped 22% and so with uh, the Chinese stock market news and what's going on there it is directly impacting the cost of things, things are getting cheaper again all this is happening as we're heading towards Amazon's prime days and the dollar is stronger and so that means more purchasing power and silver has dropped as much as a dollar recently to uh, 14 something it's now back up to 1540 does the reduced cost of silver have anything to do with the reduced cost of solar panels at this time and where is this going what I can say is that for anyone living off the grid that has considered solar power out of reach it's now within reach the other thing that I want to add is if you are considering getting solar panels let me know and get them through me and I can get several solar panels at a really great price and you can also support my work by buying the solar panels through me and so there is a uh, there is a drop in the cost of solar if this is a time that you have considered getting solar panels it is a lot cheaper than what it used to be and with solar panels come what come the electricity to run your computer if you want to watch movies all day and sit on your ass somewhere, you can do that too. Or you can use the power of the sun to power lights and have a massive indoor greenhouse. And there's all different types of foods that people can uh, grow for themselves in these indoor greenhouses. And, and later on, hopefully, I'll be able to show you what can be grown inside an indoor greenhouse. And uh, I think it is important if you have the means to have a year-round garden, especially in this particular day and age. And so let me know where you see this going if you're aware of this if you're considering getting solar this might be a good time if you have an idea why we're seeing uh, the reduced cost of solar let me know and also how this could benefit people if people were to get and amass four to five solar panels they were living off grid there's a lot of uh, uh, there's a lot of positive things that can come about from an excess amount of energy that can be used to do work so to speak I'm Alex Ansari, sign off from Southern Colorado.